Oh hello, it's me, the ukulele teacher. And I'm here to teach you how to play La Vie en Rose by How I Met Your Mother. So, grab your uke, make sure it's in tune, and sit back and relax while I teach you how to play How I Met Your Mother. The first thing I'm gonna do is teach you the intro because there's a couple of chords in that that you'll need all the way through the song. Now this song is in the key of G and that's a chord that you're gonna need all the way through the song. So let me teach it to you now and make sure that you know it. Firstly, put your first finger on the second fret of the third string, your second finger on the second fret of the first string, and your third finger on the third fret of the second string. The chord of G should sound like this. The second chord you'll need in the intro is the chord of G major 7. Now it's actually only one note different to G, but the way I'm going to play it is to bar the top three strings on the second fret. So you play it like this. The third chord you'll need is the chord of E minor. For E minor, put your first finger on the second fret of the first string, your second finger on the second fret of the second string, and your third finger on the third fret of the third string. E minor should sound like this. The next chord you'll need in the intro is the chord of C6. Now C6 really is the easiest chord of all because for that you just put your fingers nowhere. In fact, it's all four open strings. C6 should sound like this. And then the final two chords of the verse are D and D7. Now for D, you put your first, second and third fingers on the second fret of the fourth, third and second string like this. And to go from D to D7, just add your little finger to the third fret of the first string, like this. So let's just check, we've got our chords for the intro. G, G major 7, E minor, C6, D, and D7. Now the great thing about this classic old jazz song is you can play it really, really slowly. So you can really play whatever strumming pattern you like. But I'm going to try and play it similar to how they played it on How I Met Your Mother, which is a sort of lilting down, down, up, up, down, like this. So let me show you the intro then. It's just all the chords that we know. I'm going to play them through really slowly. G. G major 7, E minor, and then for C6 play two down strokes, and then one down stroke on the D, and one down stroke on the D7. So let me show you that intro again, G, G major 7, E minor, C, D, D7. And again, the cool thing is you really can play it as slowly as you like. So now that you've got the intro sorted, the first line of the verse is very, very similar to the intro as well. It's G, G major 7, E minor, C6, and D. So let's go through that first line really, really slowly then. Hold me close and hold me fast. This magic spell you cast. This is la vie on, and then two down strokes on the C6, rose, and two on the D. Then the second line, you stay on the D, then go to D7, and then back to D, like this. When you kiss me, heaven sighs, and though I close my eyes, I see la vie on, and then two down strokes on the G, and then one on the D and the C6, rose. So let's play that second line again. When you kiss me, heaven sighs. Though I close my eyes, I see la vie en rose. And again, remember you can play this as slowly as you like. Then we go on to the third line, which is really similar to the intro and the first line. It's G, G major seven, E minor, C, like this. When you press me to your heart, I'm in a world apart, a world where roses bloom. And you can just play one down stroke on the C if you like. Now the next bit is where the tune of the song changes a little bit, but don't be put off by that because you can still play it really slowly and the strumming pattern gets even easier. What we're gonna do is just play three down strokes on the first two chords and then one down stroke on the next two chords. So the four chords you'll need are C6, G, 
C6 and D6. Now, if you know what C6 is, D6 is just exactly the same, but you bar the second fret. So instead of all open strings, it's all the strings on the second fret. This is D6. So three downstrokes on the C6 and the G. And when you speak, angel, sing from above. And then one downstroke on the C6 and one downstroke on the D6. Everyday words seem to turn into love songs. And then the final line starts like the first two lines with the G and the G major 7. But then it goes to C, C6, D and G. But again, we'll go through this really slowly. Let me show you. Give your heart and soul to me and life will always be la V on rose. Let's do that last line again. Give your heart and soul to me and life will always be la V on rose. So let's put the whole thing together and play it through really, really slowly. Hold me close and hold me fast. This magic spell you cast. This is La Vie en Rose. When you kiss me heaven sighs, and though I close my eyes, I see La Vie en Rose. When you press me to your heart, I'm in a world apart, a world where roses bloom. And when you speak, angels sing from above. Everyday words seem to turn into love songs. Give your heart and soul to me, and life will always be la V on rose. That's how to play La Vie on Rose from How I Met Your Mother. I've been the ukulele teacher. If you have any requests for future lessons, let me know in the comments below. Until next time, I love you all and I wish you the best.